Yes guys, this is the new dynamic island of the iPhone 14 Pro with the new look and new features to offer. This element offers a great deal of uses. It is not the same old boring punch hole cutout or a simple pill design which Apple could have launched. Rather, Apple has made it more interactive. Apple has engineered this element with advanced display algorithms which makes the dynamic island more responsive wherever you tap, swipe or hold. And they have added animations to make it feel more natural. These animations are designed to look and feel like liquid, thanks to the hardware and software anti-aliasing powered by the Apple Silicon. As I said, the new A16 chip will make a big difference in the performance of the iPhone, and we can already see that. There is also a 31% smaller True Depth camera system engineered to free up display safe to be even more capable and a re-engineered proximity sensor now detects light from behind the camera, saving additional space for the display and the dynamic island. Just that, the features and the characteristics that the dynamic island possesses make it seem like a part of the screen itself, rather than it being an alien kind of object. Also, it functions kind of similar to a notification bar, as you can see the timer running, or the call display, or more apps display which makes it more useful than a simple punch hole or a cutout design. However, it does feel like iPhone has grown a unibrow. Anyways, uh, it's still a unique thing in the tech world and Samsung itself is implementing innovative changes. So we'll see how this change will affect the battle between iPhone and Samsung. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about the dynamic island and the new iPhone 14 Pro Max. Till then, that's all from Carbon. Fi Amanallah.